Hey guys, how are you doing? Once again, I am here uh, with another article. Hope you're not getting sick of them. I just decided to shoot one or two or three. I think it's the third one. Whatever, it's getting late. But anyways, just thought I'd share this with you. Analysts are basically saying in this little article over here, over here, I have no idea which way it goes, and most importantly, I don't really care. Apple, they're predicting Apple to be the number one personal computer maker in the market in 2012. Now, how are they predicting this? As we all know, there are many hardware computer makers, and this is specifically talking about hardware computer makers like a Dell or a Lenovo or a Toshiba, you know, the big name brand makers. So how are they comparing this? Well, in a way, they're basically taking the Mac products, the iMac, the Mac Pro, the MacBook Pro, the MacBook Air, Apple's top tier market products that are the personal computers and they're combining them with the iPad because they're qualifying the iPad as a personal computer. Now I don't know how many people feel about that and I know how, how Apple feels about that. They're calling this a post PC device. You know, a, a device that you can basically hold in your hands, hold in your lap that's a personal computer that's past the personal computer era. Now these analysts are basically qualifying this as a computer. I kind of qualify it as a computer, but Apple seems to disagree, saying it's not a PC, it's a post-PC device. You know, it's it's mobile, it's made made for the mobile world. It doesn't have a disk tray, not, it's nothing like this. It's all built for the wireless world. Now, I agree completely with that, but analysts are basically saying that, you know, even though the margins are small, 5 to 8% is Apple hardware that is sold, Apple's margins, they believe, are going to be well above 25% of the hardware next year in 2012, including Macs and iPads. So they're basically going to be the top tier computer manufacturer on the planet. And like I said, when I say computer manufacturer, I'm not talking about Windows on a computer because obviously they're not even going to get anywhere near that. And obviously they're not beating Android anymore in the uh, Android um, OS, you know, versus iOS. But they're going to be the top tier computer maker, as in computer hardware, including iPads, so Macs and iPads. Now I guess I would kind of look at this as kind of a half truth. Yes, in some regards the iPad is pretty close to a full-fledged computer. I know I could probably use it for a week or so as my main machine, you know, just because if you get most of your stuff offline like I do, you know, watching YouTube and stuff like that, going on websites. It really does feel like a full-fledged computer, even though in some ways it is limited more than a PC would be. But in a lot of ways, it does feel like a full-fledged computer. I think that's what Apple's trying to go for, you know, these post-PC devices like the iPhones and the iPads being their top markets like they are right now. You know, they, they greatly overpower the Mac. I think the Mac's maybe, what is it, a quarter or a third of their market, and it's probably decreasing uh, more and more little by little and the top thing that's really selling for Apple now at least in the Mac category are the laptops the Mac Pros and the MacBook Airs MacBook Air is a great machine by the way I own one as you can see in the review I did but I, I love the MacBook Air I love the iPad so I can kinda see where they can kinda meet in the middle and say well the MacBook Air is kinda like a PC but you know I agree <coughs> excuse me I agree that uh, this is kind of half truth I don't necessarily believe that the iPad should be considered it um, if you want to consider, you know, the post PC era, you should probably consider Android tablets and Android phones, you know, versus the iPhones and the iPads of this current generation. But what do you guys think? You know, I, like I said, I just gave you my thoughts and what I think. I think it's kind of a half truth at best. But if you want to leave me a comment below, let me know what you guys think. I'll also leave a link below in the description so you guys can check this video out for yourself. I hope you enjoyed this content. And of course, if you'd like to rate, comment, and subscribe, main word being rate comment and of uh, subscribe as well that would be awesome i do appreciate that it helps me bring you guys great content and i hope you guys enjoyed this video i'll catch you guys in the next one have a great night guys Bye bye